the ball. Today we're going to be looking at another one from the True Astonishments box set. This is from the brilliant mind of Paul Harris once again. And SOS stands for Son of Stunner. Uh, so if you know what color Stunner was, then you'll kind of understand a little bit about this effect. This is the evolution uh, and it's three amazing uh, little pockets of astonishment all built into one very simple card trick. You start off uh, by writing down a prediction. You set it down, you take the cards and you shuffle half face up, uh, half face down, 26, 26, you shuffle them in together so they're all mixed up. You then go through the cards, they stop you on any face down card they want. That card matches uh, the prediction you wrote ahead of time. Now you wave your hands over the deck, you spread through the deck, and the cards have all uh, righted themselves, kind of like a triumph uh, effect. And then the killer ending is that you flip the deck over and all the backs of the cards have completely changed color. So you can use it as a kind of color changing deck effect or I think in the trailer I do kind of a, uh, a little spiel about being, you know, the invisible deck switch and being able to switch in another deck. So a kind of a gambling deck switch routine. Uh, it's super versatile, it's very easy to do. Uh, the method is ridiculous as you would expect from the mind of Paul Harris and I know you're gonna love it. This is SOS. A lot of times I would go and I would do um, some sleight of hand stuff and people would go back in their minds and they would say, I don't know what he did, but somehow he must, he must have like switched the deck of cards for like a, a special deck or something. And it's actually almost impossible because I'd have to have another bulgy deck in my sleeve or one back here and actually try to distract you guys enough to switch in a deck. Um, the one thing that gamblers do use though is a, is a marking. They can actually mark a card so imperceptibly uh, that it, it's impossible to see unless you train your eyes for like three years. Lift up your purse a little bit and I'm going to write something underneath. Okay. Lower it a little so no one can see it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> this is cool. Good. Okay, put your, put your purse down. I'm going to write something down for you. So this is a prediction that's never going to leave your sight. It's right here. I'm going to let you know that there's one card in this deck that's marked. Okay? Okay. Now you're not gonna be able to pick it up with your naked eye, but you just have to kind of sense it, okay? I'm gonna shuffle some of the cards face up, some of the cards face down, push them together like this. I'm gonna tell you right now that the, the marked card is face down, okay? So you're gonna be looking at the backs of the card. And uh, so 26 face up, 26 face down. I'm gonna start going through the cards like this one at a time. I just want you to be able to you know, intuit it. Okay? So wherever you wanna, your spot, your card. All right, that one. This one, do you want to go deeper or you're good? That's it. Are you sure? Sure. Did you see any kind of mark on there? <laughs> I'm going with the feeling. You, you went with the feeling, I love it. Yeah. This is crazy. You stopped right here, there's, and that's out of 26 cards that were face down, right? The rest were face up. Look at this. <laughs> it's the 10 of hearts. And that is actually the, uh, the mark card. Is it? And there's proof. Lift up your purse. Look what it says. What? No way. And you know what was going through my mind? Huh. What's bizarre is what's going through my mind is like, I was listening to my intuition. Yeah. And it was like, no, 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 just next, no, no. And then you just okay, stopped, right? Okay, and that's, let's do it now. Remember all these cards were mixed face up, face down? Yeah. Look at this. Watch. <laughs> Not crazy? Remember it was half and half? Yeah. Yeah, I'm getting it. I'm getting it. <laughs> yeah no, I'm watching. But there's only one possible answer. How could they be all facing the same way now? You want to see the other side? Yeah. Would you guys believe that I actually did the invisible deck switch that I was talking about at the beginning? No. no. Look. Oh, you did! What? No. There it is, the invisible deck switch. Look at those. Make sure it's a fully different deck of cards. I, I, I am I impressed. I, Thank you, yeah, guys. Very.